This short film will show you how to use the Straight Point Center of Gravity software. This software is used in conjunction with our range of wireless compression load cells available up to 500 tons capacity. On the right here you see a sensor specification. This allows you to choose whether the load cell you're using is calibrated in metric or imperial units. Here you can see a graphic that gives you an idea on the X and Y axis and some points of loading. Configuration. This screen shows you how to configure the software. So for this instance we'll be using tunnies and our units of measurement between the load cells will be meters. You can also format kilograms, tons, pounds, kilonewtons and also the format for the X and Y measurement. So as we're using meters we will have three decimal places. Okay so now we will perform a new test. So here we can choose how many load cells we'll be using for this test and at the moment we'll go with four. We can type in a client, so for this instance, excuse my typing, we'll put in a client and an operator. I've already selected which load cells I'll be using and this is the serial number for the four load cells and as you can see each one is 500 tons capacity. I've also typed in the position in meters of X and Y of each load cell. So now we can view real time the test. If you look here on the left you can see each one of the four sensors with the X and Y position is noted on the screen. We also have a live weight reading for each load cell. Here we have the live X and Y position and a real time total load in tons. So if I apply some load to each load cell around 400 tonnies you should see there that the X and Y position for the central gravity is changing and the total load is increasing. Okay so we have 300 to 390 tonnies on the load cells at the moment. We have a total load on our X and Y position. Once we are pleased that, that is, everything is in place, everything is settled and you're happy with the test, you can press the report button. That will now generate a report. We can now open the report folder and you can see there a Word document has been prepared. We open that document you can now see it's created a report central gravity weighing report. So I have the client, the operator, the time, the date, the four load cells that we used with the X, Y position and the total load at the time of the test on each load cell. We then have an X and a Y position for your central gravity, a total weight and then a sign off at the bottom for the operator. And that is how you use the wireless central gravity software.